Looking for some place new to explore, but not wanting to make too big of a trip, a friend suggested Black Butte Lake in the North Sacramento Valley. Of course, the first thing we did is look in the area for pickleball courts, and we found them. Arriving in Chico at the community park, we expected to find eight dedicated pickleball courts. And what we found was 16 courts with a very active group of players. We are in Chico, California. Just arrived at the pickleball court. And of course, after all that pickleball, we had to find a brewery. Chico has a second brewery now, and it's called Farmer's Brewing Company. Ooh, nice little bar here. Farmer's Brewery is 100% family owned and most of the grains used in the production of the beer is grown on the family farm, which truly makes it a farm to glass beer. A one hour drive through rolling green hills takes us to Black Butte Lake. On this visit, the campground was very quiet and the army was using it for training exercises. Dark volcanic buttes sit next to the man-made lake that was built in 1963 for flood protection. It's popular for boating, water skiing, fishing, swimming, and camping. Buckhorn Campground has 93 sites on slopes overlooking the lake. When full, as it is on our visit, the lake is seven miles long with a surface area of 4,460 acres and it has 40 miles of shoreline. There are also trails winding through the trees rolling over the hills which are popular for hiking and biking. It's time to hop on Katie and hit the verdant hills and enjoy the ride. We start by taking the dirt road out to the Black Butte. It's the smallest and most geologically interesting of the three Orland Buttes. The Buttes lie along a fault at the edge of the transition zone between the valley and the foothills. Black Butte is made of Lovejoy basalt, a dense rock particular to Northern California and most likely produced by a volcanic vent near the town of Susanville, a hundred miles to the east. Heading west to the foothills of the northern coast range, we find rolling hills of green farmland and several cemeteries. Turning back, we head down road 306 and find an old historic cemetery. We continued on for a while in search of the old Stony Creek Bridge and Stony Gorge Reservoir. But it was getting late and it was a long ride back, so libations and dinner became the priority. After dinner, we took a cruise around the almost empty campground and found the military out playing with their toys. Heading home, we passed the Black Butte Bison Ranch, where you might see 200 bison roaming the grass plains. As we passed through Lincoln on our way home, we came across a new brewery, Fowler Ranch Farm Brewery. It's a family-owned brewery, and it's a part of Fowler Nurseries, a fruit and nut tree nursery that has been in operation since 1912. Oh, look at how nice this is. Look at you guys, when did you open? We are just driving home and we saw it, and now open. It's oh, yeah, like we we're in. February 8th. Well, that's a wrap for our trip up to Black Butte Reservoir. A uh, very fun trip. No mountain biking this time, but uh, played pickleball in Chico. Never been there before. Uh, took some motorcycle rides, just toured around, just places we hadn't been before. It was pretty fun. And until the next episode, that's it for us. Ciao. <laughs>